The Random Jottings of Donald J. from Nelson in Pendle. Title, Triumph of Resilience. Donald J. In the quiet town of Nelson, Lancashire, there lived a man named Donald J. who carried a heavy load. Despite facing a myriad of health challenges from the moment he took his first breath, Donald's spirit remained unbreakable. Dyslexia, a silent adversary, danced with his words, but Donald's determination to communicate knew no bounds. He poured his heart into every sentence, defying the odds with every written word. Irritable bowel syndrome played a discordant tune in his daily life, but Donald learned to compose a symphony of careful choices, embracing a diet that soothed his troubled gut. Born with a birth defect, possessing only one kidney, Donald's lone warrior endured the trials of life with grace. It fought valiantly, even as slight kidney failure in 2007 threatened to dim its resolve. The vast deference, a silent witness to his journey, stood strong, a reminder of the battles waged within. An eureze and hypertension sent tremors through his veins, but his heart beat on, an unwavering testament to his fortitude. Angina of effort, a cruel companion, whispered caution with every beat. But Donald pressed forward, determined to let his heart know that he was the captain of this ship. Chronic cholecystitis dictated a low-fat diet, but Donald savored the flavors of life within its constraints. He learned to appreciate every morsel, finding joy in the simplest of meals. Chronic prostatitis brought its own set of challenges, but Donald faced them head-on. Pain became a part of his attire, a small price to pay for the strength that coursed through his veins. Nervous tension and depression lurked in the shadows, but Donald's spirit shone through, casting a light that dispelled the darkness. He sought solace in the small victories, a testament to his indomitable will. Chronic migraines, triggered by light and sound, painted his world in shades of agony. Yet, Donald refused to surrender, finding moments of respite in the stillness of his own mind. Hemorrhoids a painful reminder of the battles fought within, could not deter Donald's stride. He faced them with stoicism, a testament to his unwavering resolve. Arthritis, a persistent foe, tested the limits of his joints. Yet, Donald embraced each day, finding strength in the knowledge that his body was a testament to the battles he had won. Cervical spondylosis, a pain in his neck, threatened to weigh him down. Dizziness danced at the edges of his vision, but Donald refused to lose sight of his path. Band-like pain around his head served as a constant companion, a reminder of the battles he faced. Pain shot down both arms, but Donald's spirit remained unyielding. Cervical vertigo brought moments of unsteadiness, but Donald found his balance in the rhythm of life. When it waned, he donned a collar, a symbol of his resilience. Fibrositis wove its tendrils through his body, but Donald stood tall. He faced the pain with unwavering courage, a testament to his unbreakable spirit. Sciatica sent bolts of pain down both legs, but Donald refused to be confined. He moved forward, each step a declaration of his strength. Low back pain and the ache in his hands were constant companions, but Donald's grip on life remained unshaken he learned to savor the moments between the waves of pain. In 2012, deafness knocked on his door, but Donald found new ways to listen. Two hearing aids became his allies, helping him navigate a world of muted sounds. Cataracts clouded his vision in 2013, but Donald saw through their haze. He faced the world with clarity of purpose, undeterred by the shadows that danced at the edges. On the 13th of November, 2014, his right arm broke, leaving his left arm weakened and painful. But Donald's spirit remained unbroken. He learned to adapt, finding strength in his newfound resilience. In 2017, celiac disease demanded a gluten-free diet, but Donald embraced the change. He discovered a world of flavors that danced on his palate, a testament to his adaptability. In 2019, 
cervical vertigo returned, testing his balance once more. But Donald stood firm, a rock against the tides of uncertainty. On the 31st of December, 2020, type 2 diabetes joined the ranks of his adversaries. But Donald faced it head on, weaving it into the tapestry of his life, a testament to his ability to adapt and thrive. Through every trial, Donald's spirit remained unyielding. He was a testament to the power of resilience, a living embodiment of the triumph of the human spirit. His journey was a symphony of strength, each note a testament to his unwavering resolve. By Donald J.